green men in outer space. 50 years ago, that's the way it was. Now, things have changed. Now people are looking at, are they a threat militarily? What kinds of sensors do we have? What kind of metrics do we have? We now have frame by frame an analysis of these objects. These objects travel between Mach 5 and Mach 20. That's 20 times the speed of sound. These objects can zigzag and we can measure the g-force inside the, this object. The g-forces are several hundred times the force of gravity. In other words, any living person's bones would be crushed by these objects. So they're probably drones of some sort. These objects can drop 70,000 feet in a few seconds. Think about that. It can drop a tremendous distance in just a few seconds, and they can go underwater. This is something that we didn't realize before, but yes, they can actually go underwater. And they also move without creating an exhaust or breaking the sound barrier. So these are things that we can now document frame by frame looking at these videotapes.